I think it's time to say goodnight. But first, let's remind everybody that Long Island Retro is the weekend of August 10th and 11th. And that our panel, our live CADcast, is on Sunday the 11th from 12.30 to 1.30 p.m. And you should buy tickets at liretro.com and come see us because it's fun. It's getting bigger. There's a lot of uh, lot of panels this year. Every year it gets bigger and bigger. Uh, there's a, something on Saturday night as well, a retro and chill event that looks fun. And at K Saunders writes in and asks... Thinking about driving from Canton, Ohio to the LI Retro event and checking out the area for the weekend. Any tips on where to stay and what to do? Do you know where Canton, Ohio is, Ship? Is that near you? It's it's where the Football where Hall the football, of Fame is. Yeah. It's not not very near me, no. Um, what you should do is go into Manhattan. So st- or go to Adventureland. No, fuck that. Don't do that. Or go to Jones Beach. Fuck that. New York City is the spot. That There's is... plenty to do on Long Island if you don't want to go into Manhattan. No, but we, I'm, let me give me. I'm giving some advice. If you can get a hotel that's like near Long Island Railroad and also near LA Retro, you can take the train into the city and see what's going on. Because come on, Wombat. I mean, Long Island's got a few things that are interesting, but you go to Jones Beach. I mean, it's a fucking beach. You've seen a beach before. In Canton, Ohio, he's never seen a beach. Well, he's probably been outside of Canton, Ohio. He's never seen. Yeah, you don't Man- know. If you've never you seen, you don't know that. If you've never Jones been to- Beach is one of the nicest beaches in the country. All right, all right. What do you fucking work for Jones Beach? I do. What do you get a, get a commission? Jones Beach tour. <laughs> get, com- get a commission. I'm sending people to Jones Beach. <laughs> uh-huh. Look, Jones Beach is very nice. I agree, and I haven't been there in a long time. But there's too many Long Island people there. I recommend not going there. It's also or a Long Beach if you can find parking. But my parents went there with Ty uh, t- yesterday. What to Long Beach yeah. or Jones Beach? Long Beach. Yeah, Long Beach is nice. I like Long Beach a lot. Yeah. My parents live in Atlantic Beach, which is the beach I go to because it's my parents live there. I figured so. it makes sense. Mm-hmm. Anyway, so we didn't answer your question at all. <laughs> um, I don't really know the hotel. I know the Marriott. I think they, I believe if there's you- a Marriott right by there that happens to be very nice. Is that the one by Nassau Coliseum? Uh huh. And I believe they have a deal with the show to get a discounted rate. Yeah. But um, is this a thing with kids now in your in in your? Because Ty's the same age as my daughter. Mm. Um, in her school, a thing that parents do now for birthdays instead of having a slumber party at the house sounds like bullshit. Okay, they have a slumber party in a hotel room. That's fucking ridiculous. That way, the girls can have their slumber party and stay up all night and do each other's hair, whatever they want to do. But the parents don't have to like clean up anything the next day. This is like white people's problems. Oh, I never said it was a problem. I just said it's a popular thing. I know. And that hotel, because it's close to my house is a hotel that Sabrina has been to like three times. I mean, like this is a solution to a white people problem. That's yeah, not I a problem. Understand. Problem not, in quotes. I, I didn't say it was a problem. How about like clean up? Like what do you... I don't know. Like, you don't have to think about it. It sounds like, it. It, to me, it sounds like, is that the parents don't want to fucking be involved, and they don't want to say no to the kid, so they're like, fuck it, let's put this kid in this box, and I'm going to be in this box. Well, there's, there's still a parent in the hotel. In the, great. I'm going to be in this box. <laughs> sure, there's lots of parents in a hotel. Yeah, yeah right. <laughs> and I'm going to shut myself off from what's going on in here and let them just do whatever and then this way, I don't have to be fucking bothered. And all right, isn't that every slumber party though? Uh, I don't know. How many slumber parties did you go to as a kid where the where the kid's dad walked in? He goes, "Hey, how's everyone doing? You playing playing Nintendo games?" That was my Can dad. I, I love that Super Mario. Can I play too? No. What my dad would do is we'd be watching like a movie or something, and he would come into the room, and he would oh he would start adjusting like the you know the lights were on a dimmer. So he would start adjusting the dimmer. He'd be like, oh, let me fix this for you. Like, obviously, I had it set where I wanted it because I, I, I know how a dimmer works. And he would just stand there because he knew it would, like, make me nuts. And he would just slowly do it and stand there until I would start screaming. Exactly. So 
but the, but it's just my but never in a million fucking years would my dad say, "Hey, I'm gonna go pay 150 dollars or 300 dollars if you're getting like two rooms." I don't know, or I don't know. No, two just be where one. do they just, stay? Just one room. Oh, one, one room? room. Okay, so the mom, one. the parents are staying in the same room. They're not in the same room. It's yeah. not like a connected. How many people are in this room? This seems like a fire hazard. Yeah, they're not allowed. Uh, no, it's not a lot. It'd be like three girls or four girls oh. and and one. Oh, parent. okay. I thought that they were like you know like joined rooms or something no all right it's slightly better but not really it still seems dumb just how about hey. how about this idea how about have the party at home and tell the girls to clean up after themselves is that that hard it's not make you know that's that's doesn't seem too bad i guess i think wombat is taking money from the hotel industry he's taking money and jones beach jones beach Adventureland, mm-hmm. a lot These of all, lot of very suspect true, things getting attention. True in this episode. statements. <laughs> These are all true statements. 